A well-executed breakout is critical to team success. A well-executed investment plan is critical to financial success. Let me develop a plan with your goals in mind. Lindell Wigington joining me here at the Sport Nova Scotia Annual Awards Banquet. Lindell, let's uh, first off, uh, congratulations on the award. Uh, I'm not sure if uh, you expected it, but uh, certainly uh, it has to be somewhat of a special moment. Yeah, it's definitely a special moment. It just a lot of great athletes in Nova Scotia. Just me getting this award uh, shows that I'm an elite athlete. So it's just a great experience getting it over other, other great athletes. Tell me about the decision to leave Nova Scotia to enhance uh, your, your development, uh, leaving and to go stateside to a, a highly recognized, uh, high profile program. Um, it was me and my family's decision. I just felt like I was going to be more focused in, in that setting. Um, yeah, it was, it was, I just wanted to be more focused on school and basketball. And no distractions around me. I didn't want any distractions around me. And that was a perfect school for me because it was isolated and a lot of players that got to the next level went to that school. So I feel like I want, I want to get to the next level. So I feel like that was a school for me. So no doubt that was, that was the right decision for you. So in what your game, you're continuing to improve, round out your game. Tell me what areas you feel you've shown the most significant improvement over the past year. Um, just being a leader to my teammates. I always want to be a leader to my teammates, pick them up when they're down when they're having a bad game or anything. I just want to be a leader to my teammates. I know what I can do on the court. Uh, I can do multiple things, So, but, but that's that's just the main part. I want to pick my teammates up at all times. Iowa State is the next destination. It won't be long before you're heading off to that campus. You had lots of opportunities, plenty of opportunities. Uh, why is that school the right place for, for Lindell? Uh, when I went on my visit, I just felt like that was home. Uh, the coaches, the people, Everybody in the city, they just made me feel like that was home. So um, just getting to know everybody there, I just felt like that was a place for me. And I know going in, I'm going to play right away. Uh, that's going to be that's going to be my play style. They fit my play style. So that's where I wanted to go in and start my next journey. You will play right away, but what will be some of the challenges as you the, the, tr the transition? Uh, just the physicality. Uh, pl players in the NCAA are grown men. They're bigger, stronger, older, you know, faster. So I just got, I really feel I got the body right now. I, I feel I can go in, I can go in and play, but you know, I just got to keep maintaining that, maintaining that and, and getting bigger and stronger and getting more weight just so I can play with the big boys like that. Speaking of the big boys, you're heading off to the, the World Cup, the, 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 the FIBA tournament. Uh, again, Team Canada will be looking to you, uh, leaning on you. Uh, tell me about that tournament and uh, how important it is for you. Oh, uh, it's really important. Just, just getting the experience to play for my country. Um, and being a leader, being a leader on that team for my country, it's just a great experience going up against the best of the best of the best in the world. You know, just getting to play against each country and see what see where we stand in the world. So, it's just a great experience. You got a medal last time, but you didn't like the color. No. Tell me more. Uh, just whenever you're going into a tournament, you want to win a medal or or go to the finals or something like that. But we we just don't want to do that. We want to go into the championship game and, and beat USA or beat whoever to win a gold medal. We don't want, we don't want to settle for for less. We want a gold medal. So you believe with the U19 a gold medal is possible? Yeah, definitely. All right, who would you see as the threats? Who are the who are the who are the powers? Who are the teams to beat at this tournament? Uh I would say USA. Puerto Rico is pretty good. Um Spain it's a lot of good teams. Every, everybody's good. So they got their best players in, in their countries. We got our best player in our country. So I just feel like everybody's everybody's good. And tell me about the preparation for this tournament leading up to it. We're, I think, two, three weeks away. Uh, we just got to train hard every day. Um, that's really it. Just just, just become more, more chemistry and have more chemistry as a team. We just got to lead up to that. Lindell, I got to ask you, and we're going to wrap this up, but um, – how, how do you measure success? Uh, some people point to statistics, championships, medals, and I know it's very early in your career yet, and there's lots of success ahead, but how, how will you measure it? Uh, well, anywhere I go, I just want to win. Uh, I just want to win. That's all I want to do. I don't really care about my individual stats. I just want to, anywhere I go, I want to win. Uh, I want to make my teammates better um, and just, just be the best I can be. That's all, that's all, that's all you, anybody can ask for. Thank you.